This banana processing plant in Kenya trains and provides research for entrepreneurs who want to develop startups in agriculture. Askanya Kwara has been making banana crisps for nine years now. When I started, I was processing uh, five kilograms per day. But uh, right now, I'm processing 1,000 kilograms. Now, as you can see, the market is growing. And the people now have known the product in the market. The company also recently started baking banana bread as part of their plan to create value-added products. So far, the bread has been sold to residents who live nearby, but plans are in place to expand production. On a good month, Aska makes about $2,000. Finally, we have our own. So I want to appreciate this, and I want to tell our locals and even people who traverse this area that have a taste in this banana crisps. They're really delicious. Kenya launched a devolved system of government in 2013 to try to hasten rural development. Businessmen in the country, however, want a more conducive environment to encourage more investment in growing towns. We as small SME, it's like we, we, the, the profit we are making or what we, the small thing that the small money that we are making from the our 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 processing it is taxed up to the end you feel like leaving the business and going back home. That's the challenge we have. Entrepreneurs like Aska are already pushing efforts to commercialize bananas while at the same time giving farmers an opportunity to fetch better profits. Maria Galang, CCTV.